Hey guys, how's it going? So I am back today with another Slim Thick Try and Haul video. So today's video is actually not a sponsored video, guys. So I did go to the mall, pick out some cute outfits. So I shopped at Zara, H&M, Target, and uh, TJ Maxx. So I got some really nice pieces, guys. Definitely summer to uh, fall transitional pieces. So I'm super excited to show you guys everything today. I'll try to put all the links down below, guys. So if you're interested in anything, just click down, click the links down below. And if you're interested in seeing what I have to offer in today's video guys I would like you to stay tuned and keep alright guys so I'm gonna go ahead and start off with the stuff I got from Target so this is a black owned brand uh, she actually had a nice little selection at Target and I seen it at the Target in Connecticut I'm sure they have another one in Brooklyn so the brand's name is called Cushney uh, hopefully I didn't chop it but I'll insert it in here so she offers like these really nice kind of affordable dresses now right now if you go to your local Target they're actually on sale so I paid the dresses were about like $60 the dress that I got for $60 which I think was this one this dress was $60 and I got it marked down for $18 bucks. and the other dress was I think $50 and I got it for $16 bucks. so everything is really discounted right now so if you like what you see in this video make sure you go and check out Target because these dresses are available right now at a discounted price so like I said she's a black owned business black owned brand um, and the dresses were really nice so I picked out two dresses that I saw so the first one is a royal blue wrap dress guys it's very pretty the best part about the dress is the back it has a little peekaboo area in the back which I thought was so slayful now this dress is a button up button down dress guys um, it's really easy to get into now they only had a size medium on the rack and sometimes I'll go between a medium and a small but I went ahead and got the size medium which worked really fine I really like the color the color for me is what really sold me it's a really nice royal blue color which definitely looks good on melanin skin tone so when I saw it I was like you know I have to get it right now you can't try the stuff on in store so um kind of shop your size so getting a medium for me was fine it does have stretch it has a lot of structure and guys eighteen dollars go ahead and support our, your black owned businesses guys because this right here was a really nice deal really good steal so the next dress I picked from her collection was this kind of like multicolor, uh, well, double color transitional satin dress. Now this one, like I said, was $50, but I believe I got this one for $16, bucks, which like I said again, is a steal. Now this one I got in a US size 10. Now she does some of the dresses in numbers and then she does them in the kind of like small, medium, large, extra large. And another thing about the company, she actually has plus size as well, so it goes up to a range that says like 20 or 22, I believe. Don't quote me on that. Check the website, click the link down below. But I thought that this was super cute, guys. It's a double color. I love the transition as well, too. It does have the slip underneath, which is actually the same green color, which I thought was super cute just for that little sex appeal. Um, the slit is actually not on the right side. The slit is on the left side, which is something I kind of find, like, a little weird but all in all I thought that this dress was very pretty guys definitely great for the season if I could sneak like something in like during September where COVID maybe go down a little bit because the uh, cases are rising now but if I can find somewhere to wear this I'm definitely gonna wear it because I think that this was absolutely gorgeous guys so definitely go ahead and click the link down below if you guys are interested in either one of these two alrighty guys so the next store I went to was actually Zara so usually when you go into Zara their prices are kind of like range from being really expensive or being kind of like you know reasonable when I mean expensive I mean like a dress that's like 80 bucks and the dress is like real basic but all in all I went to Zara and just tested stuff out so the first thing I found were these really cute kind of knitted uh, sandals or kind of like kind of like mini heels so these are really in trend and I saw them at Zara and I was like you know what I've actually been looking at these on, on other websites but you know the price range at the other websites was up there so these were actually listed for uh, 60 bucks and I said you know what 60 bucks I could treat myself so I thought that these were really cute guys um, they do fit very nice I'm regularly like a woman's uh, US 9 so this is a 40 so 40 fits me perfect they do have a lot of size which I was actually surprised about but who's really going out like that anyway so I guess the stores just have have like a lot of stuff so I was able to find my size and I saw a lot of bigger sizes too and small sizes so that was one thing that I thought was cool but I think these have like a classic glam classic chic to it so I picked them up for 60 bucks and I do not regret it at all now I did get two tops from Zara the first top I actually did pair it together with a little outfit maybe I'll insert a picture in here for you guys I absolutely love this shirt this shirt was actually only $12.90 like I said their prices range sometimes they could be really expensive and be kind of like you know reasonable so this shirt was $12.90 and it's a really nice kind of like crop top style black top now the sleeves obviously you guys can see they're really big thick puffer sleeves so it gives you that really broad shoulder 
very, very kind of 80s, 90s trends. So from the 90s babies like me, you kind of want to go back to little fun things like this. So I thought that this was super cute. It does have like this scrunchy crop top feel on the bottom, which like I said, goes with the 90s trend. So I thought that this was nice. Because I'm not sure about sizing from Zara, because I really don't shop at Zara, I did get this one in a size medium, but you can go ahead and size down to size small. So I thought this was well worth it for $12.90. Now, this next one right here, I'm definitely gonna have to go back and get like other colors. This for me was a hit hit, guys. Now, I got this one in a size large, and obviously, once you guys see it on me, boobs is a bustin' with this one. But this one is really nice. I do feel like it's, it fits my boobs, but there is like a little bit of space on the bottom portion of this one where it could be kind of like, you know, be a little bit smaller to kind of fit the waist area. But this top is super cute, guys. Another $12.90 top, which like I said, is a reasonable price. It's kind of like a nice high class type of crop top, guys. Material is very thick, and the color I'm telling you guys, I live for colors like these baby blues, lavenders, these nice kind of like pastel colors. They really work for the melanin skin. So when I saw this on the website, I was like, I have to have it. So I got it, not website, at the store. I was like, I have to have it. So like I said, with my body type, you can see a reference. I got this one in a size large, and I'm busty. So my, uh, let me give you guys my measurements real quick. So I'm 38 up here. I'm 27 and a half on the waist area, and I think I'm a 44 on the waist, on the bottom. So uh, those are my measurements. I'll insert it in the video for you guys. But all in all, everything from Zara that I got, the three items were... Alrighty, guys. So the next place I did go to is H&M, and I did pick out three items. So the first item I picked out was very basic. It's a really nice nice crop top guys that has sleeves now the reason why I got it is because I needed some more red items in my closet as you guys can see behind me I don't have that much red stuff so I want to get some more red and red just looks really good on the melanin skin tone so I had to pick this out now I got this one in a size small and it has a lot of stretch so do not be afraid of this one guys I feel like this can go with just about everything uh, shorts skirt jeans whatever great transitional piece color wise and kind of like style so I can definitely go from the summer to the fall so this this is one reason why I got it and the color just looks absolutely gorgeous so I had to pick this one out and it was only $8.99 so it was a really good steal. So this next item is a dress. Now my sister convinced me that I needed to get a size medium and I did pick the medium because we can't try the items out in the store. So this dress is actually really pretty guys. It's a baby doll style kind of dress. Now like I said, let me know if I should have got a small because I feel like I could fit a small in this one. It's really nice, it's soft, it's very comfortable, lightweight dress. I love the color pink, like I said, I love the lavenders, the light baby colors and stuff like that. So this one, when I saw it on the website, I knew I had to get, I mean website, why do I keep saying website? When I saw this in the store, I had to get it. So let me know what you guys think about this one, but all in all, I think that this dress was absolutely gorgeous. I feel like I should size down, I probably should, maybe I should take it back and just size down. I'm probably just going to keep it because it's too hot to be wearing tight clothes out here. It's like almost 100 degrees out here in New York City, so I don't know about that. I think I'm just going to keep it this way. Now, the last item from H&M is my favorite. Now, styling-wise, I'll probably wear this with like Doc Martens, just to let you guys know that's my style. And I probably won't wear a wig with it. I'll probably just wear my natural short hair because it'll just give me that edge. So this is super cute. So it's kind of like a windbreaker style, um, three-tier kind of mini dress. Now I got this one in a size medium and I'm happy I got a size medium because of my bust. I didn't want it to crush my boobs too much and this one actually fit well. It did have like a little gaping on the side which is not a big deal but for the summer and stuff like this, if you want to kind of have like that cool relaxed look, I felt like this dress was it. It is super cute guys. Now this was $24.99 and got in size medium. And just to let you know, shout out to the girl that worked at H&M because she gave out discounts. Shout out to you sis. So I did get it for a discounted price but um, this is super cute guys. Absolutely love it. Like I said, I wear this with my shorter hair, wear it with some Doc Martens or something like that and just kill it. It is super fierce and it is a great transitional because you can actually put a short sleeve shirt or long sleeve shirt underneath this and still wear it in the winter time. Word. All right, guys, so the last place I went was TJ Maxx, and I picked out two items. So the first item I picked out is this really cute maxi dress. Now, I saw it on the rack, and it was only $14.99, so I was like, it's a steal. Now, it is black, and I know everyone's like, black in the heat, whatever. So I thought this was super cute. It does have, like, the little tie strings on the top right here, which I feel is really cool, especially if you're someone that hates the really tight straps. You can actually adjust this to fit you. Now, this I did get in a size medium because this was the only size they had available, but it is really 
really stretchy guys you can actually get away with this one if you're like a little bit bigger than me um, I do like this dress as well too guys because it does have a cute little slit in the front so it has like a little bit of character to it it does have like a little bit of a plunge but the plunge on this one is not too crazy you can wear like a small cami underneath it and still get away with it for $15 for a maxi dress for the season I think that this was really nice guys so when I saw this on the on the rack I was like I'm gonna get it because it's well worth it so this was actually a really good deal they actually have a lot of stuff discounted at TJ Maxx so make sure TJ Maxx home goods and what's the other one uh, Marshalls so they actually have discounts right now so you should go ahead and check them out so this last item I got is super cute now this brand I've actually bought other items from this brand this brand is called Monroe now this is a really nice brand it's in the women's section they end up having like these really kind of like upscale kind of modern style items which I really like so this one was actually listed for $34.99 which I was not you know I'm cheap but this was well priced um, for the quality of the item I felt like it's a yes so this for me is more of a transitional piece from the summer to the fall so it does not have sleeves on it but it has more of like a kind of like sweater material even in the nighttime sometimes it can go dip down to like 60 degrees you can get away with this one so I thought this was super cute it does have the like nice scrunchy ankle style legging style kind of bottoms which I thought was just absolutely gorgeous the hoodie is actually a really nice big hoodie guys so you can actually put your hood on and still look really cute in this so I thought this was a really nice piece guys for $34.99 this was a really good deal and they have like these items at TJ Maxx like or Marshalls in the women's section kind of like that kind of modern chic type of um, apparel I guess you can call it so really nice stuff at those stores alrighty guys so that basically wraps up today's video hope you guys enjoyed today's try haul I will leave all the items down below if you're interested in purchasing anything from any of these stores but do not forget guys to thumbs up this video leave your comments down below subscribe and share this video with your friends and family people and I will catch you guys in a later one bye